zombie snipes. Okay, come on, zombie sniper. Now we put zombie in the name. We'll figure we'll get we'll get a million downloads out of it from stupid twelve-year-olds playing on their mom's tablets. Doesn't have to be a game. Just have to have zombie in the title. Who fucking cares? I'm serious. Is this the only? Is this it? Is that it? That's all I get. Are we initializing zombies here? This calls for a candy break. Oh, wait, no, we have a game. We had a game. What am I? Oh, shit. What am I doing? Oh, okay. Oh, I see. <laughs> so I'm a wizard that pisses fire, and I have to shoot spaceships. They just kind of spaz out when you hit them. It's not, this game isn't that hard, actually. This is a game I can get behind. I love the author's choice of background graphic. It's the, it's the perfect mix of what the shit. Of course, Game Informer will give it 10 out of 10. All you have to do is pay them enough, we'll give you a game 10 out of 10. All right, you guys, it's time for Half-Life 3. Look at this UFO is flying upside down. There you go. There you go. Later, man. Fixed your orientation for you. Once upon a time, the deep sadness began to spread all over the world. They reached the Earth in a matter of hours. Earth's final hope lies with the state-of-the-art laser added missile system. This system, Last Life, was developed by a company named Fawcett. The CEO of Fawcett, Nabe Ghoul, That's it. I'm done. Here's, you guys like cheese and bacon? Look, you click on this. Behold the power of cheese. Oh, look, bacon. <laughs> bacon and cheese. It's like Reddit the game. <laughs> Bacon and cheese and zombies and cat pictures and misogyny and fedoras and neck beards. Welcome to Reddit. How may I help you? Oh, is this actually playing the Ghostbusters theme? Is, some, is this Ray Parker Jr.? <laughs> bust. Don't bust. I think we're just supposed to watch this game, actually. This is, this is not a game. This is an experience. <laughs> Don't remember this from episode two, 234 of the Namekian saga where Frieza shows up and then Goku is like, nah, -uh, I don't think so, Frieza. I'm gonna uh, super super spirit beam spin kick. Oh wait, does he bounce? Oh, this is great. I just leave him alone. I beat up Frieza 28 times. I wanna, can I? <laughs> <laughs> Previously on Dragon Ball Z, Goku's instant transmission fails horribly. There you go. Let's take a look at this game. You gotta click on the cars to protect kittens. Okay, I'm gonna click on the kittens actually. Ran out of lives. The game is frozen by the way. You think the person on DeviantArt that they stole this picture from 
uh, you know, knows that it's being used for this shitty game. Oh, great. This is literally the picture. This is the picture from the title screen, and they've just very crappily cropped out Ash. This is just art theft, the game. Yeah, I'm just going to use Thunder again. Like, the person that made this knows that there's a rectangle tool in paint, right? Oh, that's it? Oh, wait, no, he was still, he was still attacking me! <laughs> I can still attack him. I'm making his hit points negative. Voltorb is a hunter-possessed Pokeball. After a little while of playing, people started noticing the artistic style of Voltorb's and Hunter's eyes were the same. In fact, its Pokedex entry states, quote, It was discovered when Pokeballs were introduced. It is said that there is some connection. If you look at the map of the Kanto region, you'll notice that Lavender Town is very close to the power plant. It's completely possible that hunters flew over and possessed a few and got stuck because of how Pokeball captures Pokemon. What, um, what sucks about this theory is that um, every haunter that you catch would become a Voltorb. So whoever wrote this is, uh, what's the word? Fucking stupid. Gengar is Clefable's shadow. This theory is not so easily proven and is more of an observed theory. You know what? I don't even care what you, I don't even care what it is because you, you can't, you can't say, uh, you can't say that it's Pokemon theory. You don't get to say that. Could Ditto be a failed Mew clone? No, that was Mewtwo. What are you, stupid? Ash's coma. Oh yeah. Wouldn't be a Pokemon theory app without Ash's coma. Oh boy, wait, 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 is this going to be that music? Oh yeah. Welcome to Namek FM. I'm your host, Kamehameha. Oh yeah. We got your naked Chi-Chi and your Bay Bulma pictures coming up tonight on the show. Find out how many vaginas Android 18 really has. Wait, this looks like it was made by the guy who did break the targets. Let's go, let's go get him. I did it. This is, this, this looks level, it looks kind of similar. I think I've seen this stage before. What's the purpose of even going down here? So I can get stuck in the wall, that's what it is. Well played. Here, this is what this music reminds me of. The use of Jokerman is renowned uh, as a symbol, international symbol of quality. Oh, oh, okay, that was a civilian then. I wasn't supposed to shoot that guy. Oh, zombie. Oh, no. My face exploded. Oh, no. I hate every 12-year-old kid that plays Call of Duty. I hate all of them. Just by default, I hate them. This game sucks. There's literally one stage of difficulty. You have 30 seconds to click or touch all 12 images in the order they are highlighted to win. Good luck. Wait, what? What the fuck even is this? Alright, so we're done. We did it. We're good. We got confetti. Um, congratulations are in order. We disarmed the bomb. We did it. This is, yeah, my wizard come. 
So I can I can pretty much just oh no nope, I can just do this and win right. Okay, well, I think we figured out how to beat this game. <laughs>